We've been waiting for you. Is this a cult? Switch is a girl who is trying to find her place in the world. And I think that she's going to be someone a lot of people can relate to. And she's definitely here to make some trouble as well. <laughs> so. <laughs> so very cagey, but uh, it's intriguing all the same. When I got the audition, I started to look up the show and I was like, oh, I've definitely seen this before online. I probably have seen the trailer um, or like ads on Twitter, uh, but I'd never watched the show. And then after I found out that I got the part, I dived into it and binged both seasons, I think within just probably about a week. Um, I watched everything and then I, I've watched them all two or three times, I think, at this point. I like to go back and just check out um, what the past seasons were like because it's easy to get so lost in the filming. It's good to remind myself of what has happened. Does your character exist in multiple worlds and multiple storylines, or is her, her storyline consistent? <laughs> um, she consistent, <laughs> yes, consistent as, as consistent as Legion it can be. Um, but Switch, she's a new character that has not existed within the Marvel Universe before this. Um, so everything is, yeah, all new and all Legion. I help people open their minds. Tick tock, little birdie. I'm the magic man. I'm not sure actually the process that they went through in creating the character or getting the approval to make this new character, but I do know that um, all the producers from FX and then also on the Marvel side, they're always working together and always talking about everything um, that's going to happen in the show. So I do believe that it must have been quite a collaborative process. Um, it seems like you're not allowed to say what kind of powers Switch may possess. Oh, I think... Are you? Am I? You can jump in if you want. <laughs> I'm allowed to? Okay. Okay, go ahead. Time traveler. <laughs> so Switch is a time traveler. She's a time traveler, yes. Um, would you want to be a time traveler, you know, to whatever extent that you could? <laughs> I think some part of me would want to, but then another part of me knows that if I could go back and change things, then the things that are happening now wouldn't matter as much. Or I wouldn't feel as... There's that... Yes, it can get quite deep, but... I think I like being a human. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to ask, what is the absolute worst superpower as far as you're concerned? Honestly, I don't think I'd want to be able to read people's minds. I think that sometimes I don't want to hear what people have to say. No. <laughs> but I'm, I'm sure that would be quite, quite a terrible thing to be gifted with. Especially if you couldn't control it. Do you know what I mean? Like if it was yeah, just like you're just constantly hotel, hearing just people. Like... Mm -hmm. um, last question is, uh, you know, Legion is a, is a stunning show, like visually and aesthetically. Has mm -hmm. there been any set or any costume or any prop that you've been like, this is fucking amazing. Like, I, this is beautiful. <laughs> Honestly, literally everything. Um, I think every time we go on set to shoot a new scene, I imagine it in my head when I'm reading the script and I think, oh, it's going to look like this or it's going to be like this. And every single time it's completely different, but in an amazing way. Um, they just go above and beyond all my expectations. So I cannot wait for people to see this show. It is beautiful. And the sets, um, they build everything. I thought that a lot of things were going to be made in CG afterwards, but they, they build it. Um, so it's just magical to walk in there. It's like being in a theme park. 